All right, guys, so we are outside today. Um, and I have my uh, agility cones again, and I got my agility ladder finally. <clears throat> so now, um, Of course, I'm not connected to internet, so I can look second. Give me one second, I gotta go back to actually. Gotta go back to my porch because for whatever fucking reason my wi-fi is not working on the side of the house and my ipad will only work on wi-fi so i just gotta okay and it's not working. So now I gotta go inside for it to connect and then re come back outside. I fucking hate this. My iPad will only work on Wi Fi, and the last time I did the workout inside, it worked perfectly fine. I hate technology. All right, I am back on Wi-Fi again. And it better stay on the side. Oh, for the love of God. I do not know why it's not working. This is insane. All right, now it's working. Okay, so this workout is a moderate intensity one hour workout. It is gonna be uh, intervals. Let's do this. Starting off, knee hugs, 20 reps. Okay. First time using a agility ladder. Oh. So, as 
because I'm trying to figure this out. These ropes are a little longer than normal. So... off at my technology. Nothing is working for me. ground and try and do this. Alright, so I'm really trying to just figure out This is, like I said, a uh, one hour moderate intensity workout. So I guess you could call it a hit workout. Um, I will be throwing some of my own shit in there in the workout as well. So, um, this ladder is a little longer than the one I used in high school, so that's why it's only taking me about forever. This is a workout just in itself.
these are not going to be perfect squares. I really wish that they would have just set this up before they sent it to me. Oh my god. So, I'm up in this workout makes me feel a little bit better my dogs have not been listening to me and i feel like i want to just knock them out so i am very irritated and then with my technology not working i just want to chuck it out the window And now that I have to deal with this shit, as it's getting tangled up, I'm just very irritable right now. Oh my god. Just to set up, I would have waited to get on till I was mostly done setting this up. Oh my fucking god. Excuse my language, too. I'm just, I'm about ready to burn this. Nothing is going, nothing goes my way. Nobody's happy. If I'm not happy, nobody's happy.
stop to be gone. I don't know if you heard me, but it's all set up. I'm just making the last adjustments. you guys to get hydrated right now while I'm finishing up the last of this agility ladder. You are going to need a wide space. So, um, since we are outside and I need space to myself, otherwise my dogs would drive me insane even more.
Okay. So my agility ladder is all set up. I guess I got one of the harder ones to assemble. Oh my God. She's the weed. All right. So now that it's all set up, um, just a few things I want to go over before, ow, before we start. Um, is on the days that we do not do the live workouts, I am gonna be posting a bunch of workouts that you can be doing on your own. Now, it is not entirely bad that you do workouts every day. I do recommend that you do take one day break. So if you do Sunday through Friday, make sure that Saturday is your recovery day. Um, that recovery day is to help prevent injury, strain, sprains. So um, I'm gonna quickly get these cones back out and then um, we'll get started. And then I'll have more info about what's to come at the end of the video. awkwardly have it. Stand tall, then lift and gently okay, hug so one again, knee in we're towards just your chest. Hold your knee for one to two seconds, then release and switch up, sides. Um, anyway, I guess I can talk about it now. Um, about the workouts. I'll be posting a whole bunch of workouts from high intensity to low intensity to just light, short, and sweet stuff. Um, and the days that I am not on live, that's when uh, you should do them. Just so that you don't start, stop, start, stop. And it's because with my schooling, I don't know when I'll be doing live workouts and when I won't. Um, like I was supposed to go on two days ago, but I didn't because of schooling and then because of a downpour. So um, I'll have those up and running on the personal training page and then also on my Facebook profile as well. I will also have um, them posted on YouTube. Also with YouTube. Um, I've been having trouble with uploading my videos. I know two of my videos or live workouts did not get posted because of the stupid music. So that's why I'm not playing music anymore because of that dumb stuff. All right. Now moving into Tin Soldiers 20 reps. Okay. Don't forget to check off the drills as you complete them. 
alternate so, lifting your legs out in front of you for a dynamic do, hamstring stretch. Opposite, uh, Keep them as straight as possible. Arm. Reach so your I'm opposite gonna, hand I'm towards the lifted wall. leg without bending I'm over. I'm going to do one side first and on the other side. You do not have to touch your toes. I'm not expecting you to. Next, reverse okay. lunge reaches 20 reps. Each side equals one so rep. Step one leg back and into a lunge lunges. position, reaching your arm from that same side up and across your body. You should be feeling this in the front of your hip and along the side of your body. Make sure you're balanced too. I don't need anybody falling over. And I did post one. Um, workout to do last week. It was a stability and mobility workout. So um, that is to uh, help you be more stable and more balanced. Jog in place for 20 so seconds. So now I'm going to use the agility Each ladder for this. One rep. It is a uh, this one is all about good place. form. Really drive your arms and stay up on the balls of your feet. Think about lifting the top of your thighs upward. Stay light and move quickly. Oh, my shirt is. Get ready for right. heel kicks. 20 reps. Count your reps. Drive your knees out in so front. Now, Keep your heels under your glutes. I'm gonna do this to the side so that you can see it's heel kicks. You're basically gonna try and kick your butt. Move your arms like you're sprinting. Be quick, Ow. soft, Don't twist and your precise. ankle like I just did. My shirt keeps coming up. That's annoying. Up okay. next, A skips, 20 reps. Each side equals one rep. Keep right. driving your arms opposite of your legs. So we're basically Think skipping. about being light and powerful. And I'm using the agility ladder for this. I'm gonna have my left foot in the one square and the right foot in the other square. Make sure for your form, you're doing ear to pocket, which is ear and then pocket. All right, next. Time for pogo jumps, 20 reps. Don't forget to check off so the drills as you complete them. Our legs Keep spread. your legs almost completely straight and get the power of your jumps your from your calves and feet. Straight Hold your out. arms close to your and body we're just doing in an athletic ready position. Little jumps. Think of being elastic and bouncing. Make sure off you the stay floor. on the ball of your foot. Set for so now we're using the agility out. ladder. 20 reps. Each step equals okay, one we're gonna rep. do start one, two, slowly three, to get four, the pattern out. right, All then right. speed it up. One, two, Stay three, light and quick four, on the balls out, of your yeah. feet. Or whatever makes sense. And you're gonna go, you're gonna have your left foot in the one um, square, the again, the right in the other, and you're just gonna go back and forth and then reach out to the other one. 
I really need to get a wider camera. I'm gonna quickly do it sideways. Oh. It's not working. So just keep doing one outside the other. All right. Now you know, moving into Highland Jacks. 15 reps. So we're gonna Remember hands to out. count your reps. We're gonna do like Start a jump with your jack. feet and arms out wide. Quickly well, like alternate that. crossing your arms okay. and feet every rep. Stay light on the balls of your feet. Move as quickly as you can, you maintaining good form. On the balls of, the, of your feet. Get set for lateral bounds. So we're gonna do ten reps. Each side this again. equals one rep. Try to go as high and far as you can each time. So generate power from your hips two. by sitting back into each landing. Alright. So to make this easier, the two squares I would normally stand in, I'm not going to. So two empty squares should be in the middle. I'm gonna see if I can make this a little easier on you guys. So these two, where my feet are at, those should be the only two squares empty. You're gonna be jumping from here to here, like that. And we're gonna do that. Hopefully, that was a little bit of a more visual. That's not totally. Uh, Spend as little time on Make the sure ground you keep as your arms. possible. Do ear to pocket too. With. Almost done. Two more. All right. Get ready. Explosive push ups. So. Eight reps. Rest when you need it, then jump back in when you can. From a push up position, we're gonna do down slowly and then a regular push up. But when we go up, we're gonna push up. So, and we're gonna do 10 of those. Start and stop. Like, if you can do five at a time, do five at a time and then do the next five. This one I'll take a little bit more time with. So if you guys have to do the modified push-up way too, where you're on your knees and do that, then that's fine. As long as you're getting that cardio push-up in. So I'm gonna do the five of the regular way and then five of the modified way. Oops. Okay. So down. Up. Okay. So now we're gonna do the modified. Three, four, five. All right. Hope that was a little bit of a workout for you. Oh my god. Coming up. So now. Climbers, we're gonna 20 do reps. Climbers. Each side equals one rep. You guys, get into a I strong high plank with position all the with your workouts. shoulders directly over so your you hands and alternate know this bringing one your knees now. up to your chest. You can do Focus a fast. Focus on keeping your core tight um, That will give you more of a workout. Your back should stay flat and still. Or you can go still. slower. So, I'm going to do five of the fast ones and then, or 10 of the fast ones and 10 of the slow ones. So we're gonna do the slow ones first. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that was the slow ones. Try and keep up with the counting for the fast ones. Alright, 
grass is a little bit sl slippery for me. Time for jump rope. <coughs> 30 reps. So now Be sure to have your we're equipment gonna do ready. Jump with both of your short feet at the same time. Jump ropes. Spending as little you can time skip, on the floor as possible. Or you can keep your arms uh, close to your body. Do a normal jump. Move the rope by moving your wrists, not your entire arm. Or you can do the skip to the one foot. Just move your wrist. Alright. Recover for 30 seconds. So now we're gonna grab a sip seconds. of water. Use this time to recover Ready? efficiently. Rest. It will help you get Hydrate. more out of what's next. <clears throat> the reason that it's only 30, 30 second rest. I'm gonna pause this. Um, the reason why it's a 30 second rest is some of you think you might be thinking oh come on 30 seconds that's not a lot to athletes that is a lot to us um high school cross country i know i dropped 30 seconds in my time at a competition literally all my teammates were happy 30 seconds is not a lot to People who are not athletes and don't work out as much, um, please don't get offended if me saying that. Um, but 30 seconds is a lot to us. Um, our bodies are working over time. So, all right. So the lactic acid and lactose. Once we use all that up, our body is continuing to work to get more energy from another location. So for one instance, in class, we learned that one, that this one type of uh, stimulus only helps, like is good for two to three minutes of activity and then it has to get uh, energy from somewhere else in the body. So our body is amazing with how it works. So we're gonna continue with our 30 second uh, water break. Make sure you're taking water. Get ready for knee hugs, 20 reps. All right. Keep your posture tall. So now, only bring your knee in as far as you can while still keeping your chest and chin up. Knee hugs. I did want to throw in some exercises with the medicine ball, but I figured what we're doing is quite enough. I don't want to overdo it with you guys. Um, some of you for the beginners or who haven't worked out as much or it's been a while, I really don't want you to overdo it. Because if you do it, that's a higher risk of injury. And I don't need that. Nor do I want that, nor do you want it or need it either. All right. Time for so Tin we're soldiers, do the 10 reps. One keep your posture again, tall. Like you Try to keep your knees straight and toes pulled back. If you need to, so you can bend your I'm knees try slightly. And do this in slow motion. When you bring your foot up, you want your leg to be straight, but you want your toe to be strictly pointed straight too. So, let me see, like that. I will see and try if I can get that to go in slow-mo so when it comes to this part of the video you can uh, actually see it more. Alright, switch to the other leg. Cool, I'm so sweaty I'm leaving handprints on the wall. So 
we're doing Get reverse lunges it. again. Reverse lunge reaches. 10 reps. Focus on your form, not your speed. Focus on keeping your shoulders stacked over your hips and your hips over your back knee. So as she was saying, I was doing it a little wrong. So when you go back, when you go back on your right leg, you want your right arm to be straight up. Down. And then same thing with the left arm. You want your left arm to be up. This helps with balance and stability. Four more. One, two, three, and four. Now moving into So we're going to do the jog, jog in, in place, place again. For 30 seconds. This Remember one, your form. Keep both arms in line with your shoulders so they don't cross Left in front of your body. Leg in the. Oh, I'm gonna take my foot. All right. So if you were outside, it would get hot. So we're gonna just jog in place. Excuse my belly fat. All right. Get ready for heel kicks. So now we're gonna do heel kicks again. Reps. Ooh. Be quick ladder. and light. Really engage your core and keep reaching the top of your head upward. I messed up my jelly water. Okay. Thank ready. you. A skips. Thirty reps. Move with control. Keep driving your arms opposite of your legs. Alright. The next drill up is so, pogo jumps. 20 reps. Same thing. Push yourself. Has Think before. of being elastic and bounce off the floor. All right. Up so we're next, gonna do the in and outs again. In and outs. 30 reps. Remember to count your reps. Once you have the rhythm, try looking straight ahead rather than at your feet. So I'm using the two middle squares. I'm just going in and out. <clears throat> All right. So now next one. So I'm sorry, I have to keep up, checking Mark. Island Jacks, 30 reps. Move with control. Move as quickly as you can with good form. Alright. Oops. Time for lateral bounds. 15 reps. Stay in control. Land so softly, do like we did but before. push off hard the into the next two bound. Squares I want empty, and we're gonna jump to the outer ones. <clears throat> hey. Get set for explosive push-ups. 10 reps. Same Take a again. short break if you need it. If you need to modify, you can do the push-ups from your knees. I'm gonna do five regular and five modified. Five. Now modified. 
One, two, three, four, five. Oh, geez. It looks like they just mowed the grass, too. So now Get we're going to do mountain four, climbers again? Mountain climbers. 30 reps. Count your reps. Focus on keeping your core tight and stable. Your back should stay flat and still. So I did five slow. I'm going to do five fast now. into jump rope 40 reps grab your equipment land lightly each Good. time use so the now, momentum from one jump earlier. to help move you into the next one i'm gonna make this a little more challenging you guys are doing great so <clears throat> i want you guys to feel what's called the lactic acid and that is what builds up oh geez watch me injure myself here that is what builds up when you are working out for a certain amount of time that lactic energy or lactic acid when you feel it burn that's being burnt into energy once that energy is all used up like I said our body will start getting energy from another source So we're gonna do one, two. All right. Recover for so 30 seconds. Have, Breathe deeply to rest. recover. Be sure to stay hydrated. Sip some Hydrate water if you more. need to. If you have to stretch. Also use this time to stretch. Time for knee hugs. All right, so now I'm gonna really add some workout in. We're gonna do suicide sprints gonna do 10 of those so one two so down and back is one we're gonna do 10 of those One last time. <coughs> Ten second water break. I anticipated so I'm sweating all right 10 
wraps. If you don't have that, uh, if they have cheap ones, go out and find one. Or if you have a Fitbit, Apple Watch, Samsung Watch, just something that will tell you your heart rate. All right. Okay. So, my phone is being pretty ridiculous. My heart rate is now at a 167, so we were able to uh, slowly slow it down. Get so ready now, for 10 soldiers, 10 reps. Stand tall again. and keep your back straight. Moving into reverse lunge reaches, 10 reps. Do this with great form. Reach all the way through your fingertips. Get set for, jog in place. For 50 seconds, land softly to reduce impact on your joints. Um, you wanna land, stay on the ball of your feet. That will uh, be less of an impact on your joints as she just said. Almost done. Up next, heel kicks. So, 20 reps. Same thing. Stay with it. Be quick, soft, and precise. Alright. I'm sorry. Coming I gotta up. keep. A skips. 40 Same reps. Thing. Think about being light and powerful. So now we're going to go into. I want this to be light. I don't want your heart rate going up too high with this. Time for pogo jumps, 20 reps. Stay standing up tall, okay. chest up, shoulders relaxed and down. Just shake your body to get relaxed. Start jumping. Right. Not too high jumps.
quick feet in so and out. We're gonna do in and out 40 again. reps. Be quick and light. Don't worry about moving your arms. It's more important to keep your core braced. doing good. Almost there. Alright. Good. So, we're going to stretch because I'm starting to feel it right here. speed so stop and start as you have to I'm gonna do five stop take a swig of water and then do the modify to the modified. Oh my god. Alright, and we're back. I swear. Sprint is the absolute worst. If you have a sprint, run. Recover oh, sorry. for 30 oh, seconds. Okay. Grab water as you need it. Be sure to stay hydrated. Sip some water if you need to.
Get ready for standing quadriceps stretch for your right, now we're on the cool down. for 20 seconds. We are almost done. Keep your got posture through the warm -up. tall. You got through the tall. workout. Use your left we are now hand working to grab on the top of your left foot down. and pull it into your glute. <clears throat> Press your pelvis forward to increase the stretch. I'm going to stand alongside the wall so I can balance. That's one thing I don't ever have. Now moving into standing quadriceps stretch for your right leg for 20 seconds. I think there's a lot faster than I do. You want it to feel a little pull in your thighs and your quads. Other side. Now use your right hand to bring your right heel in towards your glute. Press your hips forward to keep the stretch in the front of your thigh. Root down into your left foot for balance. Up next, standing hamstring stretch for your left leg for 20 seconds. Keep. Okay, so for this one, I'm gonna have to bring the camera over with me. So your feet. You want it to be slanted against the wall. And you want it, you want to feel the pull in your calf. And you want to lean forward. So we're gonna do the other leg now. This provides Charlie horses in your calves and it loosens them up so that they can be built up. So after doing that, you should feel a little looser. Keep breathing, step your left foot forward with your toes up and heel down. With both hands on your right thigh, bend forward as you sit back into your hips. Now moving into standing hamstring stretch for your right leg for 20 seconds. Now step your right foot forward. Your heel should be down with toes up. Bend from your hips and reach back with your tailbone. Get set for lower back stretch on your left side for 30 seconds. Hug your left knee up to your chest, then pull your left So we're going to be on the ground for this. You're going to lay on your back. And you want to bring your other knee, your right knee over. You want your right leg to be uh, straight. Finishing with quad rockers, 10 reps, keeping your core solid and your back flat, push your tailbone back towards your heels and then come forward over your wrists as your hips drop. Your wrists should be directly under your shoulders and your knees under your hips. Breathe deeply as you go. Guys, you have okay, 
you've completed today's workout. That was a little bit of a tougher one. So um, today, later on today, I will have workouts posted for you guys to be doing when we don't do the live workouts. Um, I will try and do better as to communicate with you guys when I can or when I can't do uh, one of the workouts. So the workouts I'll be posting later will be on the my personal training workout uh, page, also my profile as well. So um, I'm not sure what I'll have to do, what I'll be doing tomorrow. Hopefully I'll be on tomorrow, but. Rehydrate, relax. I'll see you guys tomorrow.